Hello everybody, welcome to my channel. I'm D Hicks. Today I'll be talking about the home screen launcher app called Square Home 2. It's a Windows 10 style launcher. Let's get started with the review. Okay, I had many, I tried out many Windows style tile launchers out there. This one appears to be the best. Okay, starting off, these tiles are very customizable. You can long press on these uh, tiles and hit the set. This is settings. This is to change the size. This is to delete this particular app uh, tile. And let's put, hit the settings. You got an option here. You have tap action, style, icon, label, full image, extra options. Okay, the style you just click on style, it changed the background style. You can uh, click like style five, and it changed, and you hit that check mark there, and it's changed to a yellow background. And uh, uh, if you want to change all of the backgrounds, you can just let's try it again. I long pressed on it. Hit settings. Let me go back and see. Is to see a little highlight around it. You can hit the other apps like so. And, and you can hit this here, like a, a artist panel pad here. You hit that. You can change. Hit style five. Now you changed all the backgrounds to the yellow type color background. Hit it again. Let's see, change to let's say green style eight green, and you got all the backgrounds green. Okay, you may now. Uh, now let's go back to the style one. Okay, let's take it off. Okay. Say that you want to uh, change it, uh, the background or, or the icon to uh, another image. Okay, let's change the phone icon and hit settings. And we're going to change it to a full image. Okay, I hit. Uh, that hit image here and I got a preloaded images here what I've downloaded say I wanted the phone to have like I'm going to Star Trek Steam I added a, a communicator and I changed the whole phone icon to a communicator I can customize all of these uh, tiles to different uh, uh, icons you download from the web. I found this in particular uh, communicated on the uh, uh, Google search. I just downloaded it and I'm using it as a icon. You can do that with all your apps here. You can change it out. I'm, I'm planning on doing a Star Trek theme one. I just uh, uh, kept the uh, UI of uh, what Windows 10 uh, launcher would look like. So you can really customize it to ever however you want. And uh, you have tons of options. Let's go into the application app drawer. Here, you can add uh, uh, folders. You can hit this icon here to create a folder, okay, like so. And you name the uh, folder. I'm gonna call it games folder. Press OK and then you press the application button here and choose the apps you want to go in there. I believe that's maybe all the games I got. Okay, I put play games in there. Alright, that's all the games I got on there. So I just press OK. 
hit the back button now it created a, a games folder here okay I press that now it shows in a beautiful UI the list of games that looks nice okay here you can change the uh, sorting of order default name or recently updated here okay. here you can create a new uh, category or folder or hide certain apps okay you can search your apps here search all of this okay Now, you can scroll from side to side here to your app drawer too. Now, you get this plus here. You have more options. Here is where you can add applications to the home screen. A shortcut, launcher actions, app drawer. You can add the app drawer, contacts, widgets, and tile groups. Okay there's a little bit more settings you can use here utilize here uh, tap action style icon label okay let's go back into the uh, app drawer and find uh, home options here okay this is a um, trial version of it this uh, you have to buy the key to some of these options because some of these options it's a 14 day trial some of the options won't be available after 14 days here you can change the behavior of the uh, UI you can have a tablet mode here and you, you can change the typeface here you have four options as you can see right here you have 13 days left for the free trial so some of these going to probably fade out I'm planning on buying the uh, the uh, app soon. Here you have option of infinite scroll. If you have three or more uh, pages on the uh, home screen, you'll be able to go do an infinite scroll. And here are some more options. You can use uh, system wallpaper, scroll wallpaper change the background color hide the status bar here and hide the navigation bar if you want here color you gotta have a lot of option uh, options here app lunch animation I have a current set on fly and you can have it there's three options here defaults fly fill up okay you can d uh, show notification on tile Okay, I got granted uh, permissions here. All right, apps to show notifications. We got all of them to check, but you can uncheck the ones you don't want to show the notifications if you want to. And here you can set a, a password uh, to turn. Uh, set the password to turn edit mode on you have uh, something menu lock and here you can set uh, OK Google to open from any screen uh, I didn't ask for that sensitive okay and here you can check this to say battery and data use okay let's hit back here you can change the tile size and style and you can show label always here I like this feature where you can uh, show text alignment left or right uh, uh, currently I have it on left let's go back to the home screen and show you right here as you can see it's, uh, it can be left it can be in the center or to the right here Okay, let's go back to uh, square home. 
options. Okay. And like I said here, you can uh, change a lot of, uh, you have a lot of options to uh, go through to change. Here's where it's the, uh, you can change the backgrounds of the apps here. You can uh, go through here and filter in the color changes you want to make here too. This is for like the uh, tile backgrounds. There's thousands of things you can do. Here you can change the icon style. Right now you can uh, use any icon pack you have on the your phone. Here you just simply select which one you want to use. Okay. You can change the icon scales, offsets, and background. You can change the uh, backgrounds. Uh, you can use some you can download. Um, it's a lot of options. You have to just have to play around with it. Also, it has key and gestures where you can change the uh, gestures and stuff. And a lot of this stuff you have on here, it has 13 days left for the trial. And it probably will fade out. Uh, the favorite gesture I'm using right now is to double tap to lock the screen. That option is going to be useless in 13 days after the free trial. You have to uh, buy the key. You have many options to choose, uh, many gestures to choose from if you want. If you like the uh, set gestures. Um, overall, this is a nice app. You can it's very customizable, and uh, it's the best uh, Windows Metro like UI I've seen in a long time, and I highly recommend it. And as you can see right here, it shows uh, uh, my G Plus notification, and it shows the notification on the uh, app itself that's pretty cool right there you can activate those in the options like I said this is a, a free trial version you can buy it in the Play Store and I, I believe I looked at it as I'm not sure I believe I saw it was $1.99 I'm not sure but let's let me take a quick look let's go into the applications square home now I just went back to the home screen Let's go to options here. You buy the key. Okay, it would, yeah, it would cost you $1.99. That's pretty reasonable for this uh, home launcher. It's called Square Home Key. I highly recommend this here uh, launcher. If you'd like to try this app, it's available in the Google Play Store. And the link will be in the description below. If you like this video, please like, share, and feel free to voice your opinions in the comment section. And subscribe. Take care, and I'll see you in the next one. I'll be featuring a thousand subscribers hundred fifty dollar Amazon gift card giveaway the only rule is you have to be one of the first thousand subscribers to be eligible that's it I will then randomly draw name from the first thousand subscriber list I will then post the winner in a new upcoming video the winner will then send me their info on how to receive their gift you can send that info to my channel email on the about page section.